Hello and welcome to mycadsite.com. This tutorial is on isometric drawing. And as you can see, the purple area is uh, isometric and it's combined of using three views to create a 3D like drawing. Used a lot in mechanical drafting to give a uh, better visualization. And you can see it uses the front view and the top view. That line is that line. And then uh, it's just there to give a better representation and you won't use a lot in architectural or anything so just let me delete this because we're going to start it new and the first thing I have to do is set it up so I can draw it in an isometric view and to do that I type in DDR modes and set up my isometric snap and that changes it you'll notice the cursor is now changed to be at an angle versus the standard rectangular one you'd see normally. And as I press F5, it'll change it to the front view, top view, or side view. It just toggles through automatically. And you'll see right now I'm on isoplane left, which will allow me to draw the left side in an isometric uh, plane. So I'm just going to draw the shape and here I'm just going to the top and I started at that one side so I could just clip the end point so that I wouldn't need to find out what that mystery angle is so I want to make sure it's on the right layer so I have put everything on isometric layer now and I'm going to make that my current layer so everything else I draw is now on the same layer so now I'm going to draw the top view and for that I just need to draw out a line that's two inches across and one and a half inches down. See, I accidentally drew it at two inches, so I bring it down one and a half inches and bring it back to that point. So there's the top of it. So now I'm just going to move all this so that it's within my border. I'll turn the uh, off. So now I'm just going to draw the front view and draw that out at two inches and you'll see that I turn my ortho off for a second there so I'm just going to go back and draw this front view and now my front view is drawn and draw another line to make up that so there's the basics of my block right there so now I need to draw a couple of quick construction lines so that I know where to place the circle. So right there is my circle and I need to s change my isoplane over so that I'm drawing on the left side once again. So I start the ellipse command EL and then choose the iso circle option for that see right down there so I type I enter and then I enter in my center point and then I put in my radius of 0.5 and that's drawn a circle to go with the isometric drawing and that's complete so that's the basics of isometric drawing you'll see more at mycadsite.com look for tutorial 3-2 and it'll also have some other examples as well so you can uh, learn the techniques and practice them. Thanks for watching. Bye.